an elderly gentleman who'd been collecting for years and years and years needed to find a home for his collection because his children were not interested. So he asked the Tractor Museum people whether they would make a space for it so that he would know that it was in a good place after he was gone. So um, I'm going to take you on a visual tour of his mini museum within the Tractor Museum in Israel in, in Vered. So um, these are the medical equipment pieces over here. And um, as you can see, here are some uh, interesting pieces. And on the um, end are some jewelry pieces. And here are some measurement um, instruments. They've all been very beautifully displayed. Um, <clears throat> and uh, we're coming up to one of my favorite uh, areas, which are the old typewriters, because I'm hoping when I get to North Carolina to find an old typewriter to keep on display. I remember using that one for many years. And uh, they used a printer's box to collect many, many little items. And um, you're also going to see some antique toys and a decoy duck. Here are some um, antique toys. And there's an old roller skate, the kind that you strap onto your shoes rather than having a shoe. An antique fan, a hobby horse. Um, you could spend days in here and not really see everything that's here. There are some bedpans. And now we're going to go into the next room. Candlesticks. And on the left side, little mini sewing machines. Razors, antique razors. Here's a Singer sewing machine, portable. And <clears throat> with a foot pedal, an old record player for 45s, an interesting musical instrument, some lights, and here's another record player, a uh, crystal radio. Steve had one of these when he was young that he built himself. And here are miniature tractors, cars, trucks. Um, one of the most beautiful pieces is um, somebody actually made a menorah out of a bottle. And here are some other antique menorahs. There's one up there and some gas lights. We're going to go into another room. <clears throat> Saddles and a sewing machine, a professional sewing machine. And um, tools for um, a shoemaker and cameras, um, all kinds of old cameras, very old. And here's uh, Viewmasters. We all remember those. And <clears throat> ink pads for when people used Fountain pens. Here are some of the stick fountain pens. Kaleidoscopes. Pocket watches. And over here, this is new to the collection this year because we were here last year, we have a whole dental office, the original dental office, um, <clears throat> the uh, x-ray machine, and the chair, and the instruments. The old 
ice cube tray that has the lever to pull the ice cubes out and, a, and an ice box before they had refrigeration, toasters, egg beaters, ice cream scoops, hand mixers way before Cuisinart's, an old stove, coal probably, pots, very old, and an old scale. And um, we're reaching the end here. Since I don't read Hebrew, I don't know exactly what these are at all. Um, we can find out later. And some more interesting items, little mini pictures in ivory frames and sickles. You can see that they, uh, since you can walk around here by yourself, they have a uh, security camera system and um, other farming implements. And um, I hope you've enjoyed this tour of just so many, so many antique implements.